the weather couldn't be much better from a footballing point of view. Welcome to Selhurst Park in South London. Derek Ray here in the commentary position, and I'm joined as always by Lee Dixon. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It's Crystal Palace up against Arsenal. Cheers, Derek. Yes, excited about this one. Interesting matchup for me. We should get a good game here, hopefully. Number seven, Maximilian Meyer. Number eight. Well, you never quite know who's going to dominate a game in advance, but I think you can maybe make an argument for this fellow. Lee, what do you think we'll see from him? Well, virtually everything. Quick feet, quick mind, sees the pass before anybody else. So difficult to stop a player like that. Well, this is the team Crystal Palace have picked. An element of caution about this selection. Yeah, 4 5 1, Derek. The five players behind the lone striker will need to support him. Looks a very strong midfield offensively and also defensively. The back four will be protected throughout the game. Thank you, Selhurst Park. Enjoy and this the is the Arsenal starting 11. Bert Leno gets the nod in goal. Socrates starts with David Luiz in central defence. And the main forward here is Alex Lacazette. And the contest begins. Martin Kelly. Tompkins has it. MacArthur now. He's found a pocket of space. Great strong tackle, throw in forthcoming. James Tompkins. Kelly. Max Meyer. McCarthy. A good pick out of teammate. What a shocking pass, really. Maitland Niles. Well, it's a really poor challenge. Now, what's the referee going to do about it? We've barely got started and already a yellow card. Now, will that be potentially problematic for player and official? Well, it will be because the player's on the tightrope now. He's now thinking about everything that goes in front of him. Oh, he really bruised the crossbar. Well, he couldn't quite keep the header down. Well, it was the pace on the cross. Sometimes with that much power on the cross, just cushion it, otherwise it goes over. Tompkins has it. Cahill. Jairo Riedewald. Kuyate now. Maya. Kuyate. McCarthy. McCarthy. I must say, this looks promising. Well, that's very smart defending, and now they have the ball again. Maitland Niles. Cross towards Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang, far post. MacArthur now. Maya. Well, he's given it away. This is Ozil. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Read it superbly to take back possession. Kolasi Natch, will he play it in? Well, not taking any chances and tipping that over the bar. Will this corner bear fruit for them? 
Elects to go short. Ozil crossing into the middle. So after that, a goal kick it'll be. Cahill. Jairo Riedewald. Kuyate. Maya. And that's an important intervention. And it's with Maitland Niles. He's going forward well here. Really good reading of the game to win possession back. Maya. And check. Intelligent threaded pass here. McCarthy. And cleared away. That battle won by Granit Xhaka. Kolasinac. Incisive from Ozil. Obama Yang. Lack of guile with regard to that cross. Goalkeeper's ball. And the ball with McCarthy. An important interception. So the whistle then, we're at the halfway stage in this match. The teams have had a chance to think about what happened in the first 45. Arsenal get the second half going. Lacazette still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead a oh, tremendous vision plenty of players waiting in the middle well great read there to intercept Kuyase now couldn't keep it manoeuvring his way forward well that is a defender's job to in possession to give them the lead maybe Single-minded attacking by Lacazette, who has scored. Well, here's the replay. You've got to ask questions about the back line and the goalkeeper. They're simply not there. A chance to revisit the goal. And they're playing again, and Arsenal are leading. Cahill. Palace really controlling possession, but after that it's been really disappointing. Players are looking at each other. You've got to take control, you've got to take responsibility yourself. Make something happen in this game. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Well, that's very smart defending, and now they have the ball again. And very deftly cut out. Matteo Guendouzi. Maitland Niles. This is Ozil. Jacka. Lacazette. A possession lost, intercepted. Ball's gone. Now getting himself forward is Obama Young. Lacazette! And it's gone in for Arsenal. Will they be stopped from this position? Oh. 
Well, he put some superb balls in from the wide areas, and that one's probably the best. And what do they get? Reward, a goal. And a substitution in the offing. Well, a second goal for them here. Well, it's come down to the final 20 minutes here. And giving them the gift of possession. Lacazette. Pepe. Will he finish? The shot wasn't really far enough away from the... Aubameyang! Well, it's a procession of goals. And surely there's no way they can let this slip now. Absolutely dominant. Well, we're going to see the replay. The goalkeeper won't want to see this again. He gives the ball away. Still a bit to do, to be fair. But it's his fault. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready. And now they will make the personnel change. And we're underway again. This game very much over as a contest. 15 minutes remaining. And showing fine vision. After the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick. Substitution time it is. Goodness me, he skewed that free kick completely. Wrong, wrong, wrong. Back to the drawing board, young man. And Kelly with it. And they are on the move again. He takes aim. Denied by the bar. Back in play here. Well, I for one was waiting for the net to balls, but it wasn't to be. The woodwork came to the rescue. And Cenk Chosun. Maya. And he was in the right place to intercept. And on the second half here, and it's almost, Lee, a case of whatever they've touched has turned to goals. Creating and scoring goals is the hardest thing to do on a football pitch, I can tell you. Arsenal have ticked all the boxes for me in that department. Lovely to watch. Look at all the players. They've all got smiles on their faces. We love to see that. An unforced error, you've got to say. Crossing opportunity. Opportunity, Lacazette. And he's only gone and made it a hat-trick. Well, when he's in this sort of mood, he's absolutely unstoppable. What a performance. Well, Derek, he can relax now. He's got the hat-trick. Fully deserved. Well done indeed. A chance to revisit the goal. If there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. And the referee says that is all for today. Alex Lacazette is entitled to be very pleased. Let's get the Lee Dixon verdict on Lacazette. Well, when you go home after a game, you always critique your own game performance. He's got nothing to criticise about that.